in this video we want to reproduce the figure that is displayed at the right hand side of the screen and we are given a figure that has one side to be 70 so in front of that 70 we have a square in front of it meaning that all the sides of this shape are equal and the sides are 70 millimeter now what i'm going to do is i'm going to draw my horizontal axis right from here faint line and i'll pick a point let's say this is the point i am picking on that point i'm going to measure i'll take my set square from that point i'll draw another vertical line this way can see that so from that point i'll take my meter rule and i'm going to mark 70 now i'm going to take 70 from here this is 70 here right and i'll going to thicken it because if you look at the shape here from the from this point which is that point you're seeing straight down to this point is 70. now i can take my compass and i'll do the same thing from this point this is what we have here and the um, mark here right you can take the center two which is 35 out of 70 35 i'm going to mark here so with the help of my c square and um, t square i'll place it here i'm going to draw a vertical line That again, I'll draw what the vertical line from here to this point. I see that, and I'm going to do the same thing here. Draw from this point, which is that point there. I'll draw another line this way, and I'll close it up using my thick line from here to here. Up here, you can see that now. If you look at the diagram very well, we have center lines, right? Means this figure is symmetrical. So, those center lines from here to here 70, then half of 70 is 35, and the same thing is applied here with the help of my um, T square. I will just draw my center line here to the wrong one. Short, long, short, long, short, then long. I'll come again. I'll do it vertically also. This way. I'll do the long one. Short, long, short, long, short, then long. So this is what we have here right according to the figure displayed now i'm going to place my compass i want to draw this arc you see this arc from here to this point here which is i'll place it here and i'll take it to the center right take it to the center and i'll draw this I see that I'll come to every 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 point and I'll be doing that at every point at every point at every point. 
with the same radius. Make sure that it is working together with the center here. All together. Okay, that. Now what will I do? I'm going to take my meter rule and I'll join these two ends, which is here and here. Also here and here. Also here and here. Also here and here so we'll be on that aspect now the next thing is to join from here to here noticing that there's a split here right meaning that it's passing behind that um, shape so i'm going to join from here to here but it will just be in this manner. I see that. I will also join from here to here. It is also in this manner. I will also join from here to here. It is also in this manner. I also join from here to here also, which is also in this manner. Then the next one, we are given that all through all the sides is given to be what? 30 millimeter, right? So each side is what? Is 30. I'm going to take um, my 45 degree set square this way. Okay, what I want to do, I take my 45 degrees square, place it on my T square this way. Now, if you notice something, I'll not draw a faint line to make it more easier for us. I'll draw a faint line this way across the center. Then I'll measure since we're giving this to be 30, so I'm going to measure 15 on my meter rule from here. To here is 15. Can you see that? And I'll place it at the center here. And I'm going to mark here 15. And I'll mark here what 15. So what I will do is I'll now take that 45 degree, right? And I'll place it on my T square this way. And I'll draw a line this way that will touch the sides. That will touch here to here. You can see that. Passing through this one to the touch here to pass through the figure, and I'm going to close here up and to put here up and this to be from here to this point. So, this is what we have, right? So, the next thing should be our um dimension so we'll start here you just draw your line here at this point and also at this point then you draw the vertical line from here to here and you do any tool So you put this this way. Here at seventy, and we have this this way too. You can use my forty-five degree. I'll just use this this way, and we're giving it to be what this manner thirty. So. We have successfully reproduced 
the figure at the right hand side so if you found the video helpful don't forget to like share and watch and subscribe thanks for watching